So this is a recumbent bike. In a, re in a recumbent bike, you're sitting down in a sitting position. Our demonstrator is going to come have a seat on this recumbent bike. And she's going to adjust it so as her legs are extended, all she has to do is drop her heels a little bit and that gives her an extended leg. And she adjusts it by lifting the red handle and sliding the seat forward and back. This bike just automatically powers up as she starts to ride. And what she does need to do is push the quick start button. And sometimes it requires a second push on the quick start button. It looks like it's going. Now the changes she can make on this particular panel would be to adjust the resistance. That's really the only setting here. And she adjusts the resistance by pushing the up arrow. If she gets it too high, she can set it down. There's also some pre-programmed programs in there that give you some hills over on the left-hand side, yes. Another nice option here is there's a fan built in. And it goes on high and low. So she's just going to easily ride a little bit here. Nice, smooth pace. And this would be a piece of cardio equipment that works your heart. Here we have a recumbent bike. It's a self-propelled recumbent bike. So it's not, there's nothing electronic about it. And it's a piece of cardio equipment. There are two of them in the fitness center. And our demonstrator is going to come have a seat on the recumbent bike. And she's going to adjust the seat. So as she extends her legs and drops her heels, her legs are straight. She would adjust the seat in the very center. There's a peg that you pull up and you slide the seat forward and back. It's called recumbent because you're sitting down. Similar to a regular bike, a little easier on the back. To adjust the resistance on the bike, this is the only adjustment, there's a lever on the left hand side that you can make it easier and harder. And then you just sit back and ride or you grab the handles and just go for it.